Before I made this video, I didn't know that there was this many annoying YouTubers. There's literally people on YouTube who just scream into their camera. There's people who are still making 3 a.m. challenges and still cutting open stuffed animals. And there's also people who make these same videos over and over and over again. If your favorite YouTuber is annoying, they might just be in this video. I do not fucking like this dude, bro, and his animations make me angry IRL. It was back on October 17th when I decided that I wanted to explore YouTube and find the most annoying YouTubers ever. When I was exploring, I went and looked everywhere from cooking channels to gaming channels to kids channels, and I even somehow ended up on a channel that posts fart compilation videos in 2021. Yeah, I don't know how I got over there. On my adventure though, I went through a total of 251 YouTubers. Yeah, I don't know how the fuck it took this dude 251 YouTubers just to make a video about like three annoying YouTubers on this website. Yeah, dude, you're totally not annoying or anything either yourself by, you know, fucking saying and, you know, over fucking exaggerating how your experience was. Yeah, guys, I had to look through 251 YouTubers for this. Yeah, sure, dude. You totally had to look through 251 of them. I don't know why, but I feel like this dude is just lying. I actually counted every single one and I narrowed it down to three. Three of the most annoying YouTubers ever. Basically what this dude's channel description, since I actually read it, is trying to do is he's trying to like clean up YouTube and stuff like that. Yeah, dude, you're so fucking smart trying to clean up this website. On my channel, we try to clean up the bad and weird content on YouTube. So if you want to help me make YouTube a better place, click subscribe. Yeah, no, thank you. I'd rather fucking like kill myself. Every single YouTube video I make is about bad YouTubers. I've seen horrible things. That's exactly why I'm starting this series. There's five bad YouTubers in line right here waiting to be ranked on this tier list. I have no idea who these people are yet. It's just five random horrible YouTubers. Let's see who's the worst. Welcome to ranking these YouTubers is gonna be fun. I hope they don't get mad at me and pull out a gun. Yeah, dude, you're really funny, man. Great fucking comedian over here. Five YouTubers. Oh my God. Nikocado needs to eat more avocados is the third YouTuber we're gonna rank. Of course he left and got some food. I met this guy all the way back on August 2nd, 2021 when I explored the gross side of YouTube. Okay, so while I was editing this video, I actually found out that the gross side of YouTube video, right, in the thumbnail, right, it's like some pedophilia and shit and stuff like that. Which, my question is, why the fuck are you talking about pedophilia in the same video as like a mukbang YouTuber or whatever? How is anyone supposed to take you seriously when you could be potentially talking about pedophilia or like a YouTube channel that supports pedophilia? In the same video as fucking Nikocado Avocado, no one's gonna take you seriously, your videos are inconsistent. Which, it honestly only proves my point more that this dude isn't saving YouTube or cleaning up YouTube, he's a fucking idiot. When I got to his channel, I realized that this dude was eating burgers dipped in cheese sauce, he was eating thousands of blue Takis. He yeah dude, this dude is clearly trying to clean up YouTube man, he's just like the number one cleaner of YouTube, making videos, talking about Nikocado, Avocado, and other annoying YouTubers, dude. Yeah, he's really cleaning up this fucking website, man. The serious problem that I have with Nikocado needs to eat more avocado is that he cries into his camera like every single month and says, I'm not healthy. My doctor says I'm getting sick. Bro, stop eating. Let's just rank this guy, bro. Okay, this dude is legit about to have like a fucking like mental spiral breakdown over this one dude I'm not even gonna lie to you guys dude. I actually really like Nikocado avocado bro My favorite video is the one where the one where he eats stuff. You probably don't know who Dole is I met this kid back on April 28 2021 in my worst gaming youtuber video. Oh my god, dude This dude's titles unironically piss me off like meet the fucking meet the like the worst gaming youtuber meet the worst like Commentary youtuber or whatever like this video could be titled meet the worst commentary youtuber And it's gonna be about you bro like Jesus Christ like this like meet the worst thing type of youtuber or Whatever this shit could literally be applied to anyone dude. Oh man, I forgot about J station it's funny that he's holding that sign because he is one of the fakest YouTubers ever. Yeah, dude, that guy's like the number one most fake person on the planet, bro. He's like faker than the moon landing. Yes, the moon landing is fake. How the fuck do you step on cheese? Four years ago was when I met J Station and I met him in this video. In that video, I showed off some of the content he was making four years ago and some of those videos that I was showing were insane. He ordered an LGBTQ potion at 3 a.m. once. 
In that video, they drank the mysterious potion that they got, and then his friend starts to like kiss him and chase him around like- Okay, taking this out of context, dude, the fucking, the fucking LGBT potion video, that honestly sounds like the funniest video that has probably ever been made on this website. JayStation is regarded as one of the worst YouTubers ever because of some of the videos he made. He's made horrible videos like I mentioned earlier, and he's even made worse videos. Like, he faked his girlfriend's death for views on YouTube, and he even made a video trying to talk to XXX Tentacion after he died. Yeah, dude, obviously this guy's cleaning up YouTube by fucking talking about some guy named I'm Jay Station, which everybody and their fucking family members have talked about in like 5 million videos, dude. Yeah, you're definitely really cleaning up YouTube here, man. You're like the number one cleaner of YouTube, bro. You're like so fucking smart. Wait. Does he scream like this in every single video? There, there's just no way. Well, after watching some of his videos, I figured out that he screams like that every single time. Now I'm curious, does he scream only like in the intro or does he scream like the whole video? Push that down and now the iron trap door should be dead. Now we just gotta get rid of those other stats to grab the old potion of invisibility, splash that on, wha-bam, perfect. Yep, he screams during the whole video. Imagine I did that in my video. This YouTuber is so bad, and if you watch him, you suck. Your channel is basically just an average, unfunny commentary channel. The only thing separating you from the average commentary channel is that you don't have CSGO Surf gameplay in the background. Instead, you have these little animations with your weird little fucking stupid avatar that aren't even that good. I don't know where you got this notion that you're gonna make YouTube a better place and clean up YouTube or whatever. You're not. I don't care how long it takes to fucking edit these videos, I don't care how long it takes to find the YouTubers, your videos still blow fat cock. And I actually did end up finding one. I think it was somebody on Twitter who told me to look at the YouTuber Cracky. I had never heard of that YouTuber at all, so I decided to see what the channel was all about. And once I got there, I realized it was another one of those channels that just plays this stupid truck jumping game and talks about how YouTubers barely escaped alive and clickbaits and all this stuff. You know, it's pretty funny how this dude is complaining about clickbait. His videos could be easily interpreted as clickbait. Like, look at a lot of these videos. Meet the worst gaming YouTuber. That could technically be like anyone at all, to be honest, dude. His videos are essentially clickbait. Well, actually, I decided to go through over 100 different channels and I found the worst one of them all. Honestly, I'm getting sick of editing this video, so really, here's the conclusion. Basically, the conclusion is what I said earlier. DJ Cook, you are basically just an average shitty commentary channel, but instead of gameplay, you do a little bit more editing to make you maybe above the average commentary channel that just puts CSGO surf gameplay over them talking, dude. And even then, your videos still aren't that good. I don't care how long it takes to edit these videos. I don't care how long it takes to find the youtubers or whatever i don't care how long it takes to do any of that bro your videos still suck fat cock i swear people like that are so funny dude yeah bro these clickbait youtubers making this content for like probably seven year olds even though dj cooks videos though they're probably for like older people dude they're like for old older sw smarter wiser people bro they're like for the older smarter people if you're one of those people that think you're above everyone else on this website you're not i don't care if you're making fucking toy unboxings or gaming videos or fucking political content or whatever nobody is above anyone else on this website the fucking notion that this dude is trying to push like he's like somehow better than the average clickbait youtuber is just bullshit but i'm not trying to be this big guy trying to clean up youtube so what do i know dude anyway i'm done with this video bye you are a vile slime of a human that will nobody will ever want you because you're so pathetic maybe you should calm down no i'm serious <laughs> i'm not calming down it's the saddest shit i have ever fucking heard